Next up, a linebacker 6'1", 215 from Karana, Jaden Eddington, who was a talented All-State performer, played on both sides of the ball as a running back and middle linebacker, again led the Cavaliers to a 13-1 overall record and an appearance in the state championship game, was tabbed as Michigan High School Football Frenzy's top five linebackers in 2023, earned the school's Nick Anise Award for his performance, and was a all-defensive squad selection by Prep Red Zone. See, Rob doesn't read the whole bio here. He reads just part of it. And I was really going to criticize him if he didn't say that Jay Nettington won the Nick Anise Award because that's really important. As soon as he won that, I was obligated, right, to give him, to, to recruit him. So, uh, but no, in seriousness, uh, super kid, um, not 6'1". I think if he was 6'1", he would have been D1 also. But uh, he's a... Uh, you know, he had a great year. He was their leading rusher. Um, you know, he he made you know led the team in tackles and and uh, between the twins, uh, Tarek and Wyatt and Jaden. I mean, they 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 basically drove Corona to their first uh, ever appearance in the state championship game um, in football. Um, and so uh, they did win a state championship in basketball. Um, soon after I left, uh, we when I played, we were uh, didn't win many basketball games. But when I left, they s all of a sudden got good. So um, that's kind of how my career went there. But uh, um, Jaden's just a uh, tackling machine, and so we're excited about him and his capacity to make really good good plays for us at linebacker.